Hey ladies, so I went shopping over the last like two weeks and I picked up a couple of items. I literally like hardly picked up anything. We're kind of doing like a no spend type of thing, kind of saving money. Um, and so I just picked up a couple of things and I thought I would just go ahead and share them with you guys just because I felt like doing a haul. So I was really on the hunt for Jeremiah some swimming trunks and you know, it's summertime so he needs swimming trunks. I found these cute ones at the Gap. They are so cute. He has a little surfer dude on there and they have a cute little pocket on the back and then this cute little tie right here. Um, a weird thing is, this doesn't tighten. It's just there for looks so, um, I thought that was kind of weird that it didn't tighten. But of course it's got the little mesh um, lining inside which is great. Um, these were 30% off. I don't really remember how much everything was but they were having like a sale on top of a sale. So I think it was, these were 30% off and then I think it was like an extra 15 off. I don't, I don't really remember. But um, I absolutely love these on his skin color. This bright neon orange is so cute up against his dark skin. Like, oh my goodness, it is so cute. And Old Navy is also my favorite store. So, of course, I had to go in there, too. Um, we got Jeremiah this cute, um, more orange. I don't know if you can really see the colors that well in this. The lighting in here sucks. Um, but I got this in 18 to 24 months. And... Um, it's super cute, but he has a pair of bright orange um, little chucks that I was looking for stuff to go with them or whatever because he's growing out of his little black ones that are my favorite. Um, so yeah. Oh, and the swim trunks were size 12 to 18 months. They fit perfectly. I was a little scared they were going to be small, but that was the only size they had, so I was not passing that up. Um, the next thing that we got was these cute little dresses from Old Navy. They're like little t-shirt dresses. And I so desperately needed, I got a blue one as well. Well, actually, um, Jamal got them for me. But yeah. Um, they are um, super lightweight and super cute. And they're just like the perfect thing. I can wear mine to church. I can wear it to... Um, the pool, I could wear it to go on a date, I could wear it to go to the mall, to run errands, anything, to babysit, anything, I can wear that dress. I absolutely love it, it's super comfortable, um, and I just, I just love it. But they're regular $15, and then they were on sale for $10, and then I think it was an extra 15% off of that. Um, so, it was a good price, and I so desperately need summer clothes, like, you guys, I do not have summer clothes. I have I have summer clothes, but I can't fit them. They're for my pre-pregnancy body, and I am so much smaller than my pre-pregnancy body, so all my clothes are too big. So I so desperately am on the hunt for cute little summer clothes, but I don't want to buy a lot of summer clothes because I know that I'll probably end up gaining my weight back after I stop breastfeeding. So. Um, the next place I went was Target. See, you guys know this is my favorite store, and it's right next to the mall, so why not stop at Target too? Um, so I went into Target actually to um, find some balls for Jeremiah, but they didn't have them, and I was so upset because I wanted just to put them in the pool and to put them in his pack and play, and um, so it would be like a ball pit type of thing. But they didn't have them. So if you guys know where I can get some balls. I checked out Walmart too and they didn't have them. Maybe I'll just have to order them online. Um, which I hope not. Because I, I hate ordering stuff online and the wait that it takes for you to get it. Like I like to go to the store and get it. Um, some things I don't mind ordering online. But like that. Like I want to do this activity now. <laughs> like I want to do it now. I want it now. But yeah. Back to the haul. Um, I... I am going on a more natural hair journey. Um, I've been having a ton of hair loss uh, since I had Jeremiah. So I actually, you know, I've talked to you guys about it. Like all my hair like in this area was bald. And as you guys can kind of see, it's like really wispy. But it's grown out a whole lot. But um, I'm still like pulling out handfuls in the shower. So I'm going on a more natural journey. And um, 
I just picked up some products that I've been hearing good things about and that I've been wanting to try and you know I've already tried Shea Moisture stuff and so of course I picked up more Shea Moisture stuff. I went in to look for Kinky Curly stuff because um, a couple of my friends have used the Kinky Curly and I've heard a ton of stuff about it so I was really interested in picking it up but Target didn't have any so I was really sad. They have like a detangler and a um, shampoo I think was there or I don't know it wasn't what I was looking for whatever was there was not it um, so I picked up the raw shea butter restorative conditioner with sea kelp and argan oil for dry damaged hair um, so this is what it looks like and this is the conditioner and then I got the raw shea butter deep treatment mask with sea kelp and argan oil so these two are the same like raw shea butter line that they have and um i would think that you could use the conditioner as a deep treatment but i don't know i would think this would probably be stronger it's completely different color too so this one is probably thinner and this one's probably thicker and does like a way better job but um i'm gonna try both and then i'm gonna try to use this one as a mask and see and then i can tell you guys and if you want me to do a review on these products then just let me know um, and if you want me to also show you guys how I use these products, then you can definitely let me know in the comments below, and I can do that. And um, another thing that I picked up was I absolutely love the Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Styling Hair Milk. I think is what it's called. Um, I don't have it out with me, but I've showed you guys in my other videos. It's been in my favorites and, you know, all that stuff. So the, the one that is like in a bottle like this, except it doesn't have the pump but it is on the coconut and hibiscus line. So um, I have been hearing like tons of things about this, the curl enhancing smoothie. I've seen videos of girls using it and saying their hair, this is like their hair crack. So I was like, oh my gosh, curly hair crack, I need it. So I had to try it. Um, I haven't tried it yet so far. Um, so, I don't know, but um, I'm really excited to use it, and it says for thick curly hair. I wouldn't necessarily say my hair is thick, um, but it's not thin either, but it's not, it's not, it used to be really thick, but now it's not since I've lost so much hair, but I'm still using that, um, this because it says for thick curly hair, but I love it. It kind of, well, I don't know if this one. But the curl milk, um, it kind of weighs my hair down. So I'm going to see how this does. And then I may see what line, like what products they have for thin hair. And then maybe I'll have to switch over um, to thin hair. But I mean, my hair's not thick, but it's not, I wouldn't classify, like I wouldn't classify my hair as thin, but I wouldn't classify it as thick either. So I guess it's like medium. I don't really know, but um and just like people are like, what's your curl pattern? What my hair my hair curls different like all the time. I don't I don't know what my curl pattern is, whatever. My curl pattern is carefree. There we go. A C carefree. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so um those are all the things that I got. Oh, I totally forgot. I got the cutest shirt for Jeremiah. It says Mr. Cool and the O's and the Cool are sunglasses. It's actually in the washing machine, so um, I can't show you. But I think I have a picture. I'm not sure, but I'll try to insert that. And I'll try to insert a picture of me wearing the dress. And, um, yeah, um, if you guys want reviews on these products, then let me know. Um... And I will definitely do that. So thank you guys so much for watching this. I think this has probably ended up being a little longer than I thought it was. But like I said, it didn't really get much. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye.